I've got such a crib to show you. It's better than the 50 pence. It's better than the packing of M&Ms. It's better than even David Buchan. Oh, let me show you my pair. First of all, I've got my custom bar, motherfucker. That I had the drunkest son of a bitch in the world to design me. Okay, it's, uh, it's ceramic. It's got black, it's got white. You know, it doesn't matter if you're black and white because you're on my table. And you know, we got vodka that we had vodka until I discovered it. <laughs> and we got a microwave here, motherfucker. You're drinking your vodka, you're drinking your beer, you need your chips, you need your fucking drunken snacks. It's a microwave, motherfucker. And here, here, this is where we keep all of the empty bottles of this. This is where we recycle because here in Glasgow we recycle. And let me show you, I got a special door made for this motherfucker. People think it opens there, but no, because we had so much shit to put in this, it opens like that. And fuck it, boss. <laughs> oh, fucking hell, motherfucker. It's not meant to do that. <laughs> and this is the fridge. This is a five-bedroom crib. Shut the fuck up, bro, man. This is a five-bedroom crib, but for the fridge here in Glasgow, we like to eat light. So we've got absolutely fuck all in our fridge, motherfucker. We've got a kettle, a cup of teas, and we've got my... This is my draw, motherfucker. Welcome to the special draw. You got your noodles. Hey, I had four noodles in here, motherfucker. Someone's been stealing my noodles. We got some cooking oil, but we don't need that. We got some tea bags. Yorkshire tea, motherfucker. I'm coming from Yorkshire, so I need Yorkshire tea. And we, I tried some Chinese, Hindu, Hapti, Ding, Ding, some green tea. It's very good for your nerves. It relieves the stress. It gets you relaxed. And it's the best because someone like me, someone as high class as me, with all my money, I need to relax more. And we got my plates. We got a 15 inch bowl here, motherfucker. 15 inch. I could put these on my Mercedes and they'll be spinning and be spinning. People go, shit, look at that ride, motherfucker. So that's pretty much it for this room. Oh, let me show you to the entertainment discovery lounge. Oh, we got a window. Look at this window. We can see nothing. We can see some light from the building across from us, motherfucker. And let me show you. We don't need no TV in this house. We just need that light over there. And you know, maybe your your mind's been enlightened by a certain substance. Maybe you're just sitting here and you're you're enjoying the view. You know what I mean? And we got a table here. I don't know what this is for because no one likes to put their shit in here so no one needs a table. But what I like to do personally, I like to sit down and relax in this house. Oh, now you can sleep. You can sleep pretty damn good. But let's go to the real department. Oh, one more thing to show you. If you're ever having a split or something and you drop it and it ever causes a big fire, we got this man, motherfucker. We got a fine extinguisher, handcrafted by Firepower, Firepower. So if we ever have a fire in here, or maybe Mr. Dilly Ding Ding Dings is smoking his flip and he gets too high, I can just go, hey, you've had enough. Fuck, this is good. Oh, now that's enough of this room. Let me get my beer bottle, the most important thing in the house. Now let's go check my room out. Oh, this is the hallway where, let me tell you about this life. One of us were playing football. I won't say which one, but it might have been the guy wearing the stupid hat. I kicked the ball, it hit this, this fell out, it smashed on the floor. Oh, many problems. Let me tell you about that another day, motherfucker. Oh, and this, this is, before we go into the magic room, the place where everything happens, the place that even Charlie Sheen would worship. Let me show you where everything vital goes on. BAM! That, my friend, is a top of the range heating system. It keeps all five bedrooms very warm and very bright. 
And that's an ironing board. I don't know what it's for. Maybe it's for putting someone through if you've had a few drinks. I can certainly think of a big dreadlock wearing prick. I'd like to power bomb through that table, motherfucker. But wait, let me show you where the magic happens. The Magic Central! This is Doomsday Baby! This is where everything begins! Let me show you this room. First of all, we got a Call of Duty poster. The biggest selling game of all time it's gonna be. So we've got that, we've gotta have that. And then we've got, we've got some games up there for my Xbox! My X fucking box! And then, let me show you what I play my Xbox on. This motherfucker is a 2011 series of 3D TVs big ass TV this is where you can watch everything and it feels live oh it feels so live welcome to the future I got it early because I'm a little special and I have friends in high places so I got this TV very early off the I don't want to say blabber the white market <laughs> Oh, look at that TV! Look at that beautiful TV, motherfucker! And we can even play Xbox games on it. Maybe if you're feeling in the mood, we can watch Escape to Victory on this. Very good film, by the way. But let me show you something else in my room. Let me show you my hero. I don't know why he's my hero, but BAM! Eric Canada, motherfucker. One of the best football players of all time. Why do I have it in my room? Am I gay? No, I don't play for the other side. But if I did, I'd want to be on his side. Boom! Also, we've got a picture of Mr. Bob Marley, the greatest, one of the greatest men to ever live on this fucking shit earth. Because he said one of the things that has been so true to me and since I've been in this shithole of a city, Glasgow. It says the average person doesn't even step foot on the ground for months. And I'm not talking about the concrete ground. I'm talking about the real ground where the grass and where the, the right kind of grass and, and the soil grows. That's the right kind of ground, not on the concrete pavement of a city. And that's so true since I've been living here. Let me tell you, this man is great. We've got a picture of the Stex Pistols, the UK, one of my greatest bands of all time. I love them, I love listening to their music. And then of course we've got the best guitar player of all time, one of the best Americans of all time, Mr. Jimi Hendrix, man, Mr. Jimi Hendrix. And if you look up, you will see some kind of sock <laughs> over the... Uh, the fire detector, man, I don't need to tell you why that is, but it's there. Now let me tell you the best thing about this room. Oh, let me show you my wardrobe first, motherfucker. Boom, boom. Oh, we got a t-shirt for every day of the week. And we've got my own coat hangers. For, oh, fuck. We've got coat hangers anyway, motherfucker. And then we've got the ensuite bathroom. Let me show you this one, man. Oh. Oh, I nearly lost you. The ensuite bathroom. You could fit at least three people in this room, motherfucker. We got a toilet with some piss in it. Oh, shit. We got a sink and we got a shower. Look at this. You can be in the shower and you can be in a different room. I like to call this my sauna room. Oh, see, I can have a sauna. This can be some other room for some other reason. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed my crib. You can do whatever you want now because I want you to get out of my crib. Thank you and goodbye.